Hi my beautiful Geminis, welcome to my channel. My name is Kim Enchantress. I'm here to do Halloween reading for you for the 31st of October 2018, for the week of Halloween. And I'm using the Fairy Forest card for the overall theme. And this is by Lucy Cav uh, Cavendish, sorry. And the card I have for you is the Trickster. Now this is telling me there's a lot of deceit and betrayal and it's just a reminder to be true to yourself and to um, own your personal truth. Truly at this time it's essential for you to let your uh, conscience be your guide and to live according to your own creed and with open eyes as well. So do not fool yourself into believing another person's vision and ideas are more important than your own. Questions, agendas, and be aware of people's history. For at this time, there is um, one about you who is attempting to persuade you to their cause, to join them in what they uh, see as a great task, but which, in truth, is simply a harnessing of your power to their agenda, which is not for your highest good. So, all tricksters do come across charming here, uh, Gemini, but know exactly what to say and persuade you. So. This is just their language to you. Their deeds will not match their words and what you are agreeing to by joining them will be a loss of your own personal dreams so they can further their own and they're just taking your power here. So I'm gonna pull some cards here from the Enchanted Lenormand cards by Virginia Lee and um, see what they have for you. Have four Gemini's please to tie me this theme for Halloween, please. Thank you. Okay, so we've got the Diviner card here, Gemini, and this is um, asking you to trust your instincts, trust your intuition because you're very psychic, and maybe just go within and don't be fooled by people um, that wear a false mask. So let me see what else have we got. Okay, because it can become very stressful here with the mice and this is going to cloud your judgment. Okay, There is some secrets that are going to be revealed to you and this could be very stressful around this time but just know that whatever your gut's telling you to do is the right thing. So whatever comes to you first, just go with that. There is someone around you that's not being honest to you and we'll see if we can find out who this is. Now for some of you, I feel like this is a 13 year old child who's not being honest to you. Um, there's a little bit of betrayal. They come across as innocent, but they're not really. Or maybe this is just you, for, for another majority of you, that you're getting small insights from the divine and uh, they're trying to expose a secret to you. Now this is um, to do with communication through either an email or a letter or a text message. But maybe you're going to see some writing on the wall somewhere and you might not think it's anything but it may be just a message from spirit to you. So just keep an eye open. Um, I feel it's going to do, be doing with um, graffiti type of messages that are going to come through to you when you're passing while you're driving or that kind of thing. Now with your intuition you've got to trust with the crossing here and have that faith and courage because um, you you do want new fresh start here without being deceived by people and it's definitely a fated message that's coming through. Now this could be to do with a home or family or a small house it might be, uh, maybe some of you are moving or you're looking at a small house. But it could be a child in the family that's deceiving you. Uh, just be careful. Now we have um, the bouquet here and this is, um, this is a card of beauty and invitations. It's also about using your talents and skills and I feel that you're very intuitive. Maybe some of you are painters and you paint um, spirit or um, you can paint um, spiritual ancestors or guardian angels for people. I do feel you have a talent with your hands and I do feel, feel like in this it is to do with painting. 
So that's a nice message that's coming through. I do feel like for some of you, you're going to be renovating a home, a new home. Maybe it's just a small home. And uh, with a tree here, this is um, a message that's about expansion. So there's, things are going to grow, but it is asking you to be patient. And it also, um, also is about ancestors and past life here with the tree. It's a, your overall vitality. But maybe there's some secrets um, to do with a house or a house that you're looking into that hasn't been known yet. But when it's revealed, things are going to start expanding for you. But it's just asking you to be patient. This is a, a very patient card. Now I'm going to use some cards, um, use the deck for from the Animal Tarot deck. And this is by Dorian Virtue and Radley Valentine. See if they've got a message for you. What do you have for Gemini's, please? Okay, and we have the beautiful koala that's come out. And this is the four of winter here, Gemini. But it's asking you to think uh, things through very thoroughly before you make a decision of any kind. If you overanalyze the situation, it's not going to get, a, get you any closer to your solution. But if you just pray and meditate with, with the crossing and, and the diviner here, this is the uh, Mademoiselle uh, Lenormand herself. And this crossing is about having faith and believing um, between heaven and earth. And we're closer because the veil's closer to each other. You're going to receive these messages very clearly. And a secret will be revealed. Now, for some of you, you may be studying health as well. And um, or maybe there's a secret um, health problem that's coming through on, on a family member for some of you. Uh, but there could be an invitation also to a child's party here around Halloween. Maybe it's a Halloween, wearing a Halloween mask or something like that. But, um, but there is some stressful uh, secrets that will be revealed. I'm going to pull a card from the Romance Angel cards by Doreen Virtue and see what it entails for you love birds out there. Just bear with me, Gemini. Thank you. Okay, so there's definitely um, about healing family issues. So it definitely ties in with the house here. This is um, about your family, your close knit family. This is where you feel, um, you know, uh, your foundations are and you feel safe. This is where you lay your head at night. And the tree also ties in with family as well and your ancestors. So the, the tree is about healing and just having that faith that your intuition's guiding you in the right way. And maybe there's some secret family issues that are gonna come through here for you. And this is what's affecting your love life at the moment. And it could be to do with parents, and you, some of you need to forgive your parents. Maybe it's telling you, so you don't carry the energies, it's just saying that you forgive them for what they've done, but it doesn't necessarily mean that you agree with it. It's just so you don't carry those energies into your future path. Now um, I'm going to pull one last card here from the An uh, Archangel and Gemstone deck and see what messages the Archangels have for you. What's your out? Come for Gemini please Spirit. Just for Gemini for Halloween 31st of October 2018. Okay, and we've got the shell fossil here. So it's saying, are you ready to uncover memories or wisdom stored within your consciousness? So this is about revealing something with the book. There's secrets in here. This is about your knowledge and your memories of, and your wisdom that need to be um, uncovered. And it could be through family that this uh, stands. Now it's saying, spiral inward to understand your dreams and visions. Recognize the value of the past and use it as a stepping stone for your future. So whatever burdens you had in the past here that's caused stress is about to change because you've got the, the uh, bouquet here. 
maybe this is with uh, a niece or an auntie maybe it was um, healing family issues with a, with a relative but you have so much wisdom within you so you need to use it here Gemini so that's a beautiful message for you for Halloween but I've just got last uh, affirmation for you from Archangel Jophiel and this is what they want you to say in your spare time your quiet time when your mind's at rest wisdom is stored in my cells and bones I am conscious of my intelligence I tap into ancestral knowledge so it's definitely tying in with, with the tree here meditation comes naturally I go within for guidance every day I integrate sorry integrate and process all that I perceive with ease so this message is going to help you bring everything to light and so you can move forward on your future purpose and your path it's going to uh, enlighten you so I hope this has been good around the week of Halloween my name is Kim Enchantress I have put a link below if you want me to connect with your energies because I said to all the other sun signs that it may not resonate with every one of you out there or your viewers just go to your moon and rising sign or seek one of my beautiful um, co-workers on the YouTube channel some beautiful people out there some very talented readers who may have the message for you so love and blessings. Happy Halloween. Bye for now.